Hi guys, welcome back to Style with Substance and welcome to another haul video. I am hauling some items that I picked up from River Island online, so if you want to see what I picked up then please keep watching. And there's some really, really nice bits in here, so I urge you to stick with me. So everything that I ordered came in this black bag here, it's got the River Island logo on it but I've taken everything out so that it's easy to show you what I bought. The first item and I like to start with some of the good stuff first and not like do that whole save the best till last thing is this top which I'm pretty sure is going to wash me out so I'm going to show it to you quickly and then skip straight to the try on. So it is a white shirt with some really really gorgeous um, bell sleeves and lace cutouts right there where your sort of um, lower arm would go. It is long enough to, you know, keep you decent, keep you modest, and it's got a nice slit at the back there that you can see, which just really, it just skims the body really nicely, and I think it falls in just the right place. I picked this up in a size UK 6, which is, not sure what that is, I think it's a Euro, European size 32, and it was £32. So that is item number one, hands down one of my favourite pieces from this haul. I should also mention that this top I'm wearing is also from the same order. So it is a black print frill cold shoulder blouse. I picked it up in a size six and it was £35. And I just really love how it kind of shows off the sort of um, collarbone there and your shoulders, but arms are covered and it's got a little peep hole there so I think it's it kind of shows the right amount of skin which is not too much but really complements I guess what would be your more feminine area. So this next item that I picked up is something similar to a jumper that I bought recently. So it's this mustard, I'd say mustard, I don't know, but more of a greeny jumper, v-neck of course. And what I love about it is it's got this really unexpected lace. I don't know, if, well, there's not a top inside, it's just um, a lace trim on the inside, which you kind of wouldn't expect, but I think it adds a really nice sort of dainty feminine touch to it. And um, if you didn't want to kind of just do the whole masculine jumper thing. So this would go really nicely with either a pair of white denim jeans or, or black actually, to be fair. So, really really loving the um i guess what's the word i'm looking for loving how unusual that is because you wouldn't have expected that the next item is a copy of the white top but in pink and in a slightly more i'm gonna say cotton feeling material actually it could be the same material i think it's just the color that's throwing me off but it's the same top as the white one i showed you earlier but in pink and I just got both because I wanted to see which looked better against me. So again, it's washing me out, so I'll skip straight to the cutaway for this one. Exactly the same as the other one, but it's just in this gorgeous mauvey pink colour. So it'll be interesting to see which goes better against my skin. But again, as with the white one, I picked that up in a size 6. So I think online it's called the Pink Crochet Trim trumpet sleeve top so that was 32 pounds then i picked up some more work appropriate knitwear and this what i love about is it's not too thick so it's this uh color block bat wing jumper which has this nice blush pink cream and a black panel which i think would look really nice with a pair of blue jeans or maybe a pair of gray jeans actually if you really wanted to switch it up i picked this up in a size six as well and it was 30 30 pounds i do like the bat wing sleeves but i'm not always the biggest fan um but in these colors it definitely gets away with it so that is that of all the items in this haul this could hands down be my favorite i'm gonna go out there on a limb and say it is it's this gorgeous gorgeous black bodycon dress with these amazing bell sleeves and now what I love most about this dress is that it gives you that silhouette it's black so very flattering for all body types but then it gives you that drama right here so it's not just your simple LBD it gives you the drama on the sleeves and just really really takes it up a notch I picked this up in a size 8 just because I wanted it to be really fitted and it's 35 pounds but this is a winner. 
ladies if you're looking for a cocktail dress that's kind of out of the ordinary and has a bit more of a casual vibe i would definitely definitely recommend this it's going to shape you and sink you in in all the right places you're just going to be able to be quite versatile with it so if you wanted to wear it with tights and sort of ankle boots in the office or like pumps heeled pumps you could do that but if you wanted to wear it on a night out and jazz up with an updo and like really big earrings you could also do that so, so this haul is kind of like office appropriate stuff but also stuff that you can wear if you're transitioning from the office to a night out which is why i picked out this jacquard weave skirt i picked up in a size 10 because i'm slightly bigger down below but it was 30 pounds and it's part of their neo classic range it's just got this gorgeous pattern on it which you probably won't be able to see on the screen but it's there's kind of a lace like a mesh uh over the a black mesh over the sort of cream bits but it's quite delicate so you, i don't know if you'll be able to see it so it looks like that at the front and then it's got your classic slit at the back so this is just a nice jazzy pencil skirt which i would kind of pair with either a black shirt or a white shirt if i kind of wanted to do the sort of I'm in the office, but I'm not going to be boring. Look. So, love that. Then, another office appropriate, but also holiday appropriate piece is this, which I'm quite excited about actually because I don't have anything like this at all. So, it's this frilled dress. I got it in a size 8 and it was £40. So, that's a Europe size 34, but it just looks like this. It's a v neck. Um, it's got really gorgeous pattern on it, so mostly I'd say mustard black and white, and then it's got these lovely frills down the bottom there, which really kind of give it a bit of a Spanish senorita vibe. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but it's got a nice tie detail there, which I think you can fasten to make it tighter, although this looks like um, that crossover bit is very much sewn into place. Very, very sexy, but also very, it's giving me beach vibes as well, so you could kind of pop that on in the office with tights and pumps if you wanted to. Probably more summer appropriate, but you can make it work in the winter. I feel like if you were going out for drinks with friends after work, then this would really kind of work well. Nip into the toilet, slip off your tights and give it a more nighttime appropriate look. So this next dress is for, and I, I, in, unintentionally I've done a lot of patterns in this haul because I just think that I tend to do quite plain colours quite a bit so I thought let me introduce some colour and some more excitement into my hauls. So this is for the woman who wants to look professional but also wants to inject a bit of personality into a sort of office dress. So I picked up this and it's not going to be to everyone's liking but nothing is. So it's this sort of chiffon silky type dress I picked up in a size 8 and it was £45 so it's long the sleeves have a lace panel here just after the elbow and it has a tie in the front so you can cinch in the waist or not it's kind of casual Friday so I would rock this with tights and ankle boots or if I were not in the office, I would rock it with over the knee boots. As much as it would cover them, I don't know, I'd quite like the vibe of that. And this would go really well with the next item that I'm going to show you. So yeah, just a really like fun camouflage print dress, but it just goes to show that camouflage can work in the office. I'm like clashing all these patterns. <laughs> Okay, so the next item is a pair of shoes. It's the only pair of shoes I got in this haul. And they come in this sort of river island box with the nice cute leopard print. We just open them up together. And I was talking about heel pumps because that is exactly what I picked up. Let me take these out of their bag so you can see them properly. Right, so here they are. So it's these gorgeous brown pumps. They are faux suede. And I am a UK size 6 in shoes, which is a European... 39 they just look like that really simple but i think just the style of pumps that i like pointed toe and stiletto heel especially for the office because i'm not going to be wearing it like walking around loads so it's manageable there they were 35 pounds and they're just in this gorgeous brown color which would go well with both of the dresses that i've shown and the skirt and pretty much any of the tops depending on sort of what color jeans or trousers you're wearing but brown or this sort of tan colour is just gorgeous. I would even say it's, it's like a tan or camel, I'm not really sure, 
but I, obviously you'll see a try on of these with one of those outfits just to show how versatile they are. And then last but by no means least is the final item which is this white v-neck crossover top with a nice tie detail and sort of big big frilled sleeves. Not much to say about this other than the fact that it would go really nicely with that pencil skirt that I showed you earlier. In fact I might pair that with these with this in the try on. I picked it up in a UK size 6 and it was £35. It's simple but if you don't want to do a boring white shirt then this is what you do. With a lot of these tops with the chunky sleeves obviously it restricts the kind of jacket you would wear so I would recommend that if you have an oversized jacket or a sleeveless gilet, faux fur gilet then that would be the way to go with these. So they can be quite impractical in terms of like wearing in the office but you can kind of make it work depending on what coat you've got. So that is the end of my haul guys, I uh, hope you have enjoyed it. I don't think I've ever hauled, apart from a coat, like a bunch of items like this from River Island. So I thought I'd switch it up, try a different store and I'm going to go through as many stores as I can just to give you guys a sneak peek into what they're all doing currently. And also if you've never shopped in there to kind of give you some inspiration to get online or to go in store and, and pick some stuff up. So thank you so much for watching guys. Subscribe for more hauls. Um, I'm uploading three videos a week on a Tuesday, Thursday and a Sunday so do come back in a couple of days. I'm sure there'll be something for you to check out and I am also selling loads of items on my Depop so my name or my Depop account will be linked in the description box below. I'm getting rid of a lot of my dupes so my Louis Vuitton Neverfall bag dupe, some of my coats, some bags, loads of stuff so get over to my Depop and get shopping. Otherwise I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!